Air costs money to ship. Latter-day Saints around the world can now receive printed copies of the Book of Mormon, manuals, sacred garments, and other church materials shipped to them more quickly. Bishop Gerald Cosey of the presiding bishopric of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints dedicated a new state-of-the-art global distribution services center in Salt Lake City on June 8th. This place is much more than a distribution center. Thanks to you, its influence will spread throughout the entire world and will bless generations of members. About 200 church employees gathered at the distribution center for the dedication. We are excited to dedicate a really brand new facility, one which will provide and distribute church materials and temple clothing to church members living around the world. The new facility is a massive 339,000 square feet in size and is located in an industrial area near the Bishop Central Storehouse on the city's west side. Everywhere we have a member, we need to get them essential materials so they can make and keep covenants. And so this, this facility ships about 75% of the world's volume to our members throughout, throughout the world. An estimated 40 million items will be shipped from the new facility every year to help meet the spiritual needs of the face 17 million members. Unlike for-profit entities where, you know, they go to a market because it makes sense, because it makes economic sense, we don't have that luxury. We, uh, we have members throughout the world in, in, in large countries, in large cities, on small islands, in villages that it's our responsibility. I would say our pleasure uh, and our blessing actually to serve them and, and ensure that they get what they need to make and keep covenant. Managers say the new facility is more efficient. Up to 6,000 custom-made boxes are shipped out daily. So if you go online and you order, make an order, typically you'll receive that order within three to five days. In the previous facility, it may have taken seven to 10 days. We are, I believe, state of the art in terms of the technology that we use here. And that makes me very happy to think that members of the church will benefit from this technology.